Hello everyone, Creative Venus here. This time I'm excited to introduce a very unique PowerPoint template. What's amazing about it is that I've designed it in Figma and then exported it to PowerPoint. I found Figma particularly user-friendly and simple to use. The entire template is designed with a blue theme and a corporate look. It includes a variety of widely used presentation infographic components all of which are unique. You can enhance its appeal by adding animations and styles in PowerPoint to make it even more engaging and interesting. The export process from Figma to PowerPoint is incredibly seamless. Here, you can view the slides in PowerPoint. Now, you have the freedom to edit, animate, and update the slides as needed. The infographic elements are both unique and visually appealing suitable for incorporation across your slides. These infographics serve various purposes, such as showcasing strategies, key points, steps, workflows, and more. I've focused on making them realistic, incorporating effects of light to enhance their visual impact. Now let's design a slide together so you can learn. In this slide, I'll insert three squares with rounded corners one by one. Next, I'll apply gradient effects to the squares and then add a glossy light effect using custom shapes. Keep watching and you'll learn the steps easily. They're quite straightforward and I'm sure you'll love this. I've applied a gradient fill here, flowing from the top left to the bottom right direction. It's essential to grasp the direction of the gradient. Next, I'll duplicate the square. Figma makes it easy with shortcuts. Simply press Ctrl plus D to duplicate the shape and then you can edit it as needed. Now you can follow along with what I'm doing here. I'm going to add one more square at the center and apply a gradient fill. By the end, you'll see it will form a beautiful shape. Please watch until the end to learn how to achieve this. Now this part looks particularly intriguing, especially with the square at the center. I'm going to add one more square at the top and turn it into a layer to showcase the light reflection. I'll achieve this by editing the shape, making it cover only a portion of the base shape. Additionally, I'll apply a white gradient flow to create the illusion of light reflection. Continue editing the shape until it fits perfectly. It may take some time, especially if you're new to it. After this, I'll adjust the gradient flow to ensure the light looks natural. I'm going to add some depth now. To do that, I'll duplicate the shape and apply a layer blur effect. Then I'll move this layer to the back of the main shape. This will create depth and make it look very natural and nice. There you have it. The shape is completed. Now, you can add content and you know how to do it. To save time, I've increased the speed of the video here. Similarly, you can effortlessly create various slides in Figma and then export them to PowerPoint. However, it's crucial to understand the narrative of your presentation beforehand as this will guide your decisions regarding the slides and their designs. Each piece of content requires a customized design to effectively convey its message. 
Additionally, you have the flexibility to tailor the theme of your designs by incorporating additional elements. For instance, if a slide focuses on sustainability, you can enhance it with graphics such as greenery, trees, windmills, and more, depending on the topic at hand. This process can be both enjoyable and fulfilling, as it allows you to unleash your creativity and bring your ideas to life in a visually compelling manner. Here is the final result and the template. Enjoy, like, and share. Download links are available in the description.